What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, we do unboxings, reviews, vlogs, anything you have to do with Barbara Conti, you can find on this channel. So thank you for tuning in today. But today we're going to be unboxing a clipper, a new clipper from the Pissed Off Barber that you can find on Amazon and also the Pissed Off Barber website. Um, no better day than today. It is Valentine's Day. And who doesn't like some candy on Valentine's Day? So we are unboxing the TPOB candy, as you can see here. I'm gonna go ahead and dive into this box and see what the clipper is all about, what kind of contents come inside the box as well, and let y'all get a peek at it. Once again, thank you for tuning in. Let's get to this unboxing. Look, I just flipped the switch. All right, also, as you can see, we got the TPOB candy. Here's the clipper charging dock. And uh, there's the branding on the bottom, candy on the side. You have the TPOB candy branding on the back. And then also your color key for all of your guards. So you have a essentially a, a A, 1, B, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, which is a half guard 1, 1 and a half, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. So those are the guards that it does actually come with. So we'll go ahead and open the box and let you guys see what is inside. All right, inside we have the actual clipper. And here on the side, you can see the slam branding, the slime branding as well. So let's go ahead and pop this bad boy open right here. And you can see the actual clipper, which we will put to the side uh, first and get to the contents of what's actually in the box. So in the box, you have your user manual, of course, your operating instructions, how to care for the clipper. Uh, put that aside here. We have our charging dock, as you can see there, a pink charging dock with the TPOB branding on the bottom. And then also uh, some more information on the bottom there and the area where you actually plug in your power cord. So we'll put this aside here. Next, we have uh, your four guard and your three guard. So three and four guard. You have your two guard and your five guard in that bag. Your one and a half, your half guard in that bag. And then also your one guard and your six guard in that bag. Your clipper oil and your brush, of course and your USB charging cord. So you can plug this into uh, like your cell phone charging block and uh, plug that into an outlet. And then this goes into the actual charging dock here. So I'll take one of these guards off so you can see how it looks, give you guys an idea of what kind of guard that we're working with here. So we'll go ahead and take this number one guard out. There is your number one. And uh, we'll see how it snaps on the clipper once we take a look at that. So I'll set this aside and we'll go ahead and throw everything else back into the box and get to the best part, the clipper. So the moment of truth, we got the clipper here. We're gonna take this plastic cover off here. Here is the actual candy clipper. I'm digging the uh, matte pink here at the bottom, like the grooves where you can stick your fingers, hold it in place. Uh, we'll go ahead and take the blade cover off here. And there is your blade. Very nice looking blade. I mentioned in my Instagram story that this is very similar to the uh, the JRL blade, but we'll get more into that here in a second. But it is also a click lever, has the click lever system, and it does have an LED screen here at the bottom. So you turn this on and you can see how many minutes or how, how much percentage you have left of your power. So that's at 100%. You have two other indicators down here at the bottom. On the right side, you have an area where it says to plug it in. Then on this left side, it's an area that says that you need to oil your clipper. So that's how the clipper sounds. You guys can hear that. Not an extremely loud clipper. But um, yeah, we'll dive more into uh, the specifications of the clipper and let you guys know what's going on with it how many RPMs, and uh, more information about the blade here, so. All right, everybody, so there is the clipper there. You can see, I'm going to take this one guard and snap it into the clipper, so you can see how uh, snug the, the clipper, or the guard fits, and see, so snip snaps right in, snip snap, snaps right in, and uh, sounds great, sounds very powerful. Go ahead and take that off there. But this, uh, this clipper right here is 7,200 RPM, um, it does have a blade that uses the steel, Japanese steel, 440C Japanese steel, which is generally used on shears. And also the actual cutting blade on the inside is a ceramic coated blade. If you're not too savvy with blades, uh, ceramic blades tend to not get as hot as quick. 
So that's why a lot of people put on ceramic blades on, on their cutting blade because it creates less friction between the two metals, which creates more heat. So with the ceramic blade, it'll ultimately be a lot cooler. So I'm looking forward to using this in the shop and letting y'all uh, see how it works. But like I said, 7,200 RPM, it's just as, uh, just as fast as the slimes, I believe, or the slimes may slightly be a little bit slower RPM. But like I said, when you turn it on, it sounds very powerful. You can feel the power in your hand. I'm digging the uh, the matte pink color here. I'm, I'm not much of a gloss type fan of, of uh, gloss paint on clippers, but I dig that. I like how you can see all the internals. That looks pretty cool. See the actual board, circuit board there. And uh, I am digging this LED screen as well that shows you how much time is left as well. So, um, I mean, there's really not much to say about it. The next thing to do is to get it inside the shop and let you guys know how it operates and uh, let you guys know what I think of it after using it. Out of the box, it is not zero gap, so you will have to zero gap it, which is not gonna be hard at all. You just undo these two screws here, and then you uh, slide the blade down slightly to get it to where you want it to match up, and that's uh, your zero gapping right there. But I do like this, uh, this is metal as well. So I like that lever right there, the click lever. Um, I like the black accent more uh, than like gold. Um, clean clipper, clean, clean clipper. And I'm digging that it comes with a charging dock. So when you get in the shop, like I said, stay tuned for a future video to come where I actually use this in the shop and let you guys know how I ultimately feel about how it cuts. But uh, right off the jump, I'm digging the, uh, the weight. I'm digging the uh, style. And if you want to purchase these yourself, they are $70 after taxes with Amazon Prime. It'll get you uh, two to three day shipping on if you have Prime to wherever you at in the continental US. Or if you are out of the country in the UK or wherever you may be overseas, you could go to the pissedoffbarber.com, uh, use my promo code JBLENDS to save yourself 15% off your purchase. But I appreciate everybody for tuning in and uh, checking these out. Uh, happy Valentine's Day to all y'all out there. Uh, you know, TPLB is coming up on the rise. Got a lot of different products coming this uh, 2023 year. So looking forward to where the company goes from here and uh, seeing what else TPLB drops. So other than that, I hope everybody has a good day. God bless.